Okay, hey everyone, I'm Kiana. I don't know what's gonna go. Okay, I'm a little nervous, oh my goodness. You're good, I got, um, it. Okay. got this. Deep breaths is what I tell all my clients. So thank you so much for having me. Wow, super fun, right? Um, so my name is Kiana Parker. I am a boudoir photographer here in town. So the sexy But to me, boudoir is so much more than that, and I'll tell you why. <laughs> so how many of us have? Um, how many of us hate to have their pictures taken? I see a lot of hands. Um, definitely photographers are notorious for this, I myself included. Um, it's just something that we're not really good at. So how many of us take a look in the mirror and we kind of like what we see? I know I do. But then I see those ugly Facebook tag photos where I'm looking like Fraggle Rock and I'm like, what are you doing? Don't tag me in those photos. <laughs> Why is that? So in a world where selfies have been the namesake for like the last 10 years, why do we all still suffer from that kind of negative perception of ourselves? I'll tell you why. So, a lot of us think that we're not photogenic. Um, a lot of my clients see my photos and they want to be that person. They want to be that woman who eludes the sexual confidence and sensuality who they um, see, but they just don't think that they can do that. Um, and that's wrong. So, um, you know, through their negative perception of themselves, they psych, some, they psych themselves out that they think that they can't do what uh, I do. So I have an experiment for you guys to test tonight. Um, I want you guys to take a portrait of yourself, uh, not a selfie, not a selfie. Um, have someone take it for you or take it of someone else and uh, take it into Photoshop. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna flip the image around. So you're gonna have two of the same images facing each other, except one is the mirror image. And what you're gonna notice is that it looks completely different. And that image that you might like more that's the image um, that is basically kind of your reflection in the mirror. And that's the face that you know. It's not the heinous fraggle rock individual on Facebook. <laughs> your reflection in the mirror is the face that you know, not what the world sees, because we all think that you're beautiful. You look great in that picture. What are you talking about? You look awesome. She indeed feel awesome. So basically my talk is kind of about my client experience and how I'm trying to educate my clients on shifting that perception of themselves. You know, I can't erase the decades of negative talk and low self-esteem with one photo session. Um, it does take, you know, a journey, as I say, but at least for the afternoon I can help shift that perception for them. I want to help them see themselves the way that I see them, right? Boudoir photography to me is obviously more than just sexy photos. It's an intimate experience with yourself um, through the eyes of another. Uh, I tell my clients that they've never met the woman that I see and that she's beautiful. Okay, okay, a couple more slides, promise. <laughs> Um, a boudoir photographer in my industry once said that um, her number one goal is to spread the epidemic of confidence. A confidence once can achieve anyone in my eyes. So how are you setting your clients up for success and how are you filling their cup up? Thanks. Thank you. I love that you two Fraggle Rock references. Yeah, that's